Yes, you did read the title right. Minecraft actually has new armor now. Well, kinda. Minecraft developers just released Snapshot 23W04A, and it comes with a lot of new features such as new armor trimmings, a new method to get netherite, new enchantment glint, and so much more. Sit back, grab some snacks, and let's jump right into the snapshot. To start, there are new patterns you can finally include on your armor. There's actually over 600 combinations Minecraft has included for new armor trimmings. How cool is that? There's actually armor templates for each structure in the game, incentivizing players to actually go out and explore their world rather than stay in just one area, like I sometimes do. Genius, right? Some, however, are rarer to find than others, such as the Wardens found in ancient cities and jungle temples, as well as woodland mansions. Aside from armor trimmings, armor can can be fully color customized and it looks super nice as well. Me personally, I like the purple the most with netherite armor. Once you find an armor trimming of your choice, you simply get an ore and combine it in the brand new smithing table interface which Minecraft has also decided to upgrade in this snapshot. First place your trimming design, next a piece of armor that you would like to upgrade, and then an ore. Now you can fully customize a piece of armor in vanilla Minecraft. Is it just me or does this feel like some mod? Anyways, moving on, this snapshot also added a new method of getting netherite making it harder to obtain, which I'm kind of happy about. For the past few versions of Minecraft, netherite has been easy to obtain. Simply light up some TNT tunnel in the nether, mine ancient debris, get some gold, and boom, you got netherite. However, with this snapshot, there is one more tiny step to this process. You must raid a piglin bastion. The item you'll be looking for is the smithing template which you'll be used to upgrade your diamond tools and armor from diamond to netherite. To find it you must find a treasure room in a bastion and open a chest that happens to have one. To use this on the smithing table simply repeat the same process from earlier in the video and boom you're done. The last major update for this snapshot is the enchantment glint found on enchanted items which now seems to be much more simple and elegant compared to the bright shine in previous versions of the game. Overall, this snapshot was one of the most interesting and coolest ones of all time and included one of the best cosmetic updates to ever be in Minecraft. Let me know your thoughts down below on this snapshot and I'll see you in the next one.